Hello beautiful people, I'm Davy Baby and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how I recreated this Normani Met Gala look. I'm not a big fan of fashion shows or award shows, but when I saw that photo of Normani on Instagram, I was taken aback. I was just like, girl, you're killing it. You look good. You look more than you look good. You look great. So I figured why not recreate her look. So that was my attempt on this. So if you would like to see how I achieved this look, stay tuned. So we are going to start off by priming our face with the Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream. I actually got the sample with my latest Sephora order and I loved it. Absolutely loved it. Next, I'm going to follow up with the Danessa Myricks Yummy Balm Powder in the shade number 9. I'm going to be using this as the base of my face with a brush to buff it out. I followed it up with the Item Beauty Concealer in the shade 410 and placed that in the areas I wanted highlighted along with my eyes. Feel free to take a concealer brush to buff out the concealer and blend it with the balm powder. Once that's done, I prime my eyes using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Eye Primer so that the colors I'm about to put on my eyes pop. I start with the brown transition shade in the Makeup by Mario Matte Palette. Now, Normani had more of a blended cut crease, so we wouldn't want too much of a demarcation. So that's why you constantly see me blending. Next, I tap into the lime green shade in the Natasha Denona Trial Chrome Palette and press it on the lid. Next, you are going to tap into the dark green shimmer and apply it on the lids as well for added depth. I then tapped into the Pat McGrath Mothership 5 palette for the white shimmer and applied it as a topper for my eye. This way I would have an added shine on my lid. I then lined my eyes with the Scion Blue shade in my Norvina palette just to give a little extra oomph, you know. Once we are done with the eyes, we are going to set our face using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Translucent Setting Powder. Now to bring life back into my face, we're going to bronze using the Juvia's Bronzer in Dark. So I place this on my cheekbones, forehead, and also use it to contour my nose so that I have extra definition. So Normani has this vibrant blush on her cheeks, so we're going to try to mimic that using the Artist Couture Love Sprung Palette. And we're going to use the darkest pink shade to make sure this look is bright enough. Because I'm going for a bright under eye effect, I used the Huda Beauty setting powder in Kunafa and let it bake as I went through the rest of my makeup. So going back into the Juvia's bronzer, I'm going to line my lips with the darker bronzer shade to mimic the soft reddish brown that Normani has. And in the center of my lips, I will be using Abu Dhabi from NYX Cosmetics just to give that dimension. I went ahead and did my lashes off camera and dusted off the powder I used to bake my face. Once all of that is done, we have completed our look. We are Met Gala ready, y'all. Let me know if you guys tried doing this look in the comments. Tag me on Instagram if you do. My Instagram is at DabyBaby, so go ahead and tag me. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.